Hello everyone, welcome back. Uh, we're doing more Spec Ops The Line. Um, yeah, and uh, so we have to redo Chapter 2 and Chapter 3 because there was a video corruption. So, yay! It's awesome. About five minutes into our last attempt was uh, basically just blank video for no explicable reason. Is he good? Oh. Yeah, you suppressed weapons. Reloading. Uh, so like, much for that stealth. Yeah, it's so stupid. But, you know. Yeah, because you were yelling, you idiot. Yes. Oh, and this. Yeah, this is the first part you actually get grenades. And they're pretty useful. No. Yeah, I'm totally, totally aimed a little too high. See, they even give you the the handy. Uh, throw arc. Yeah, that was the last minute, like, I, I bumped it up a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> now we're going to be doing chapter 2 and 3 in this episode, mainly because it's so short. Like, two, chapters 2 and 3 are really short. Other chapters get longer, so... There you go. So, yeah, if you, if you couldn't tell... Grenades can be used to like throw up sand and kind of that's kind of why I did it kind of distract or Disorient your enemies. It's actually pretty handy um, Especially since there's enough sand around so it's very decent. It's very decent uh, No one's gonna get that no one's gonna get that reference if you get that reference You've been with us for a very long time and we thank you. I think too long. Yeah, you've been with us too long time to move on Go to go to better places. <laughs> oh, do you still alive? I want to execute him. Yeah! Yeah, and I think we mentioned this in another episode, whether it be previous or future episodes. Uh, We're speaking episodes, from the future! Th episodes three. From the world of tomorrow! Episodes three and four, I think it's like, we're like, yeah, he gets, as he gets uh, further through the story, he gets more and more aggressive and stuff like that. And, and this is one of the things I don't like about doing redoing an episode because of stupid things like corruption is now it's like, what did we talk about in, in the episodes 3 and 4 that we can't really talk about now? You know what uh, I mean? Yeah, that's true. You probably should have rewatched those just to be sure, but you know what, hey... Are we watching for chumps? I don't want... I don't yeah, we... Want <laughs> we're, we're not that amateur. What, what did you... Oh, intelligence. Oh, I didn't realize. What intelligence? There was nothing there! There was sand. <laughs> <laughs> that is the most important intelligence because it can make glass. But yeah, we're uh, going through this, what is this, TV studio? Yeah, it's a television studio. That, for whatever Ed, Edward is pretentious enough that he has to say television, not just TV. Look, it's a television studio. Oh, well, sorry. Look, I'm sorry, I work at a television studio. I know, I know. I get it. Yeah, you better. Oh, hey, do you, do you, I, just real, I just realized I didn't mute my phone until just now, so is yours muted? Yeah, well. Okay. Oh, that's right, you got the smartwatch. The smarch. The smarch. Lousy smarch weather. <laughs> yeah. I think it's funny because they, cause they uh, just announced the um, Apple Watch this week. Yeah. And everyone's like geeking out over it. And I'm like, you, you realize they haven't really talked about any functionality that that thing actually has. Yeah, that's the weird thing. It's like, yeah, it's an Apple Watch, but what does it do? Oh, we don't know yet. Yeah, they're just kind of like, it does everything. Well, what does it do? Explain to me, please. It, it does more than your mortal mind can me can handle. No, nah, they totally they totally appled that where they just they they blinded everyone with a lot of like good, like words. Yeah, words that I'm having trouble today. Stop. Yeah, Eduardo has been we, we, Eduardo had a lot of trouble today with his words for whatever reason. Yeah. Because earlier today we yeah. went to uh, a local <laughs> comic convention. Yeah. And it was actually a lot of fun. I've never been to one before. Um, but, you know, I got, I got some stuff like, oh, you can break the glass to release the sand. Yeah, I know. I just Remove the evidence. <laughs> Wipe the bodies off the platform or something. No! But yeah, we went to a, a local comic convention and, uh, you know, it was a lot of fun. I've never been to one before, but, you know, it, I, I still want to go to the San Diego Comic Con. That would be a few cool. months away, though. Yeah. That'd be really nice. Yeah, we don't have the money for that yet. Ooh. Y yet. You know what's, you know, 
your trip that you're taking, you might be able to hit that up too. I'm not San Diego now. I'm gonna I'm going I'm gonna be going to Anime Expo. All right, well, hey, you're going to something. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be going to Anime Expo in J- I think the July. Gone. I should have. So worked. if you guys are in the LA area and you kind of just are going to an Anime Expo, maybe we'll maybe I'll see you there. Who knows? And not even realize it. Not even. <laughs> yeah, it's like I'm not even. I'm not even gonna tell you that it's me. Wait, what's your other weapon? Oh, it was the, um, the, whatever. The one that had the silencer on it. Whatever, it's not important here. Well, I was gonna say, I like using the M4. I think you have, I think you have a Mac 11. You know what I mean? I think you have the little, like, bot, max, matchbox, machine, like, sub, uh, pi machine pistol. I think. You do. You have the micro, S <laughs> micro 9mm. So you gave up an assault rifle for a little dinky gun. No, I gave it up for this. Well, you yeah, but you kept the micro for no reason. Yep, there is a reason. Is there? Oh, I thought yeah. I killed you! You can't. You can't get rid of him. Because he has to do that. That's scripted. Oh, is it? Yeah. It's really stupid. Oh, that's, that is dumb. That's because it forces you over here. And I didn't realize it was scripted at first. I thought it was like one of those, oh, it just happened. But no, it was scripted. Take out these guys, they're too close for my, for my liking. And too close to the one side. Yeah, ambushes are always fun, aren't they? Oh, you, totally. got, you also gotta wonder, though, how they have so many people in this building, and yet not all of them come out to fight until you get... Like, they have a quota. No, no, no. You can't go out until there's until there's less than 15, play, 15 enemy uh, soldiers, mm. for whatever reason. Uh, I always hate this this portion because it just feels like it just takes forever. Well, it, of course it does because it's a scripted event. It's I know. it's a stupid. Uh, oh yeah, hey, we're gonna force you into this this firefight because you must be here because this is what progresses the story. Yeah, I know. Story story pieces like this are always really really annoying because even this happens, so it's like okay. Now, Going into the the vortex of doom. It is a it's the uh, the maelstrom in the desert. Maelstrom, fancy word for whirlpool. Not the appliance brand either. Or it could be the appliance brand. Could be, but isn't. Not what I was referencing. Says you. <laughs> but yeah, we're we're only. <coughs> Nice. I'm sorry. So we're only like eight I'm minutes dying. in. <laughs> we're only like eight minutes in, and uh, chapter two is done. So chapter three. Yeah, chapter two was literally just like run. It's just let's get to this point. Yeah, basically. Now, uh, oh yeah, back to the comic convention. It was a lot of fun. Um, I've never been to one before, so it was. A very, I've never really been to one either. That was, was kind of the first one I've been to. It was a very, I just know more about comics. Yeah, it was a lot. I'm, I'm not really a comic book person, so I'm not as well versed in the lore or, or anything like that of any kind of comic series, so I'm kind of like, uh, sure, let's go. Um, oh yeah, and you can break the glass and people, enemies can fall. Which is, yeah. he walked forward and fell, so he didn't really fall through the glass. It's not even shot. my fault. But, uh, but yeah, it's like we, uh... Oh, where the heck did you get... Whack. I hate how it gets you stuck in that animation and you still get hurt. Yeah, no, it's dumb. I've died so many times doing that. See, when you get stuck in an animation, you should be invincible for that animation. There should be no, no like... Oh, yeah, maybe... See, that's what uh, I like about, um, Batman. Yes, that, that's... That whenever whenever you pull off the, the special moves, you just, you just... Pull them off. Yeah. But yeah, we went to the... the, the like, I'm, I'm not too well-versed on comics or anything like that, so I was kind of, like, out of my element a bit. But there was a section that had, like, games and Pokemon cards and stuff, and I was actually... I actually got a couple, uh... Pretty nice Pokemon cards. Um, from the you first... say nice, but they're, uh... They're just their first right. gener... Their first generation yeah, right. Pokemon cards, and they're holographic, including a promotional Mew card. Which you got for a dollar. Yeah, which wasn't bad. Um... I mean, I even got a set of three ja uh, Japanese Southern Island set cards. I think it's a Meryl, a Lapras, and something else. I can't remember. Um, oh, mm -hmm. and I got a... You can't remember. I can't remember. It, it, I, I look... I, I, I can see it, but I can't remember what it is. 
Wow, they kind of threw that C4 like a frisbee. Oh, but. The C4 is right behind us. There's yeah, no way. No, no way. The There's no way would, that that. The shockwave would have killed us. Mm -hmm. But uh, but yeah, I got the those, and I also got a bunch of uh, video game perlers. For those who don't know what perlers are, it's you know the the little beads that you stick in a pattern and you can iron them and they melt together. Those are perlers. Um, I'll, I'll probably take some pictures and put them on the video just so you guys can see. Uh, so I got like rupees, including a glow in the dark one, um, an ocarina. Uh, a little Yoshi, a big Yoshi, three Mega Mans, one for Mega Man, the Mega Man X series, and one regular Mega Man from the NES series, mm -hmm. both blue and red, and also, uh, Samus. Samus. From, a run. From Me Super, uh, Super Metroid, I think. So, it's... Awesome, I liked it. It was fun. I had a lot of fun. Although there were a lot of people there that you could tell it was like the the nerdiest of the nerds. Yeah. Because I mean, it, and every person in high school has had this person in high school, in like in their grade or Every whatever. person in high school has had this person in high school. Yes, my words. Shut up. Your words were worse today. Uh, and we'll get to that in just a second, but, you know, the... Uh, there's always that person who wears, like, those really baggy black pants mm -hmm. that have all the chains going around it. Yeah. And that, like, the... <clears throat> I, it's not a, tra not a train conductor's hat, but it looks similar to it. I forget the... I don't know I think it is. I think it, I think it is just called the conductor's hat. Yeah, something like that. And it's like... You could you could see the weeaboo. In the, like, the anime like just leeching out of him into the atmosphere that sounds about right and every person in high school has known someone like that you may it's it may have been you if you don't know that person it's you yeah <laughs> most likely anyway uh but yeah uh so after the convention like other than that there were like things like the uh uh there was a clip like a bunch of klingon cosplayers which was kind of awesome actually it, it was kind of cool but i mean some of them were a little little strange. Like, the one was a woman that was carrying around a doll. Like a human baby doll, for some reason. I, I thought it was an actual, like, person. I didn't actually look at it. It was a doll. I, I didn't want to stare, you know? I didn't, I didn't really, I don't, I don't, I try not to, because some, so I've had the tendency that people look at me, and then they're, like, I, they see me looking at them, and they're like, why are you looking at me? I'm like, yeah. I'm just, you're the one just like a freak here, it's not me. It's not my fault. Well... Nah, I wouldn't say freak. I would say more like. Well, when they act like that is one is one. Oh yeah, when they when they act like that, that's yeah. just no. Other than that, it's I awesome. Would, I wouldn't even call that freaky. That's just rude. That's just an asshole rude comment. Nah, you're right. That is just rude. Because I mean, you're the you're the one who's dressed up in a way that like uh, draws attention to yourself. It's exactly. Like, do you not do it because you want people to look at you? Or I mean, I get it that you want to do it because you like it, but. There's also no, there's always usually another reason. Mostly, I want to have other people like look at my costume, or look at how much work I did, or whatever. So, thankfully, none of them were like that. I actually, I was there was Hawk Girl. That was oh yeah, yeah. She came in um, like as shortly after we did, and I thought it was awesome because she was actually because she actually sort of looked looked yeah, the she, right. Yeah, she looked. Well, she aside looked, from aside from a shortage of wings. She looked the right. Yeah, part. That, well, the wings would have been really awkward to, to mm -hmm. use, but but she had like the mace and the mask and the boots and all that kind yeah, of stuff. Yeah, the right cool. color coordination. Yeah, it was actually really well done. So there was also what is it? There was a guy walking around with a lightsaber. That was that's like a standard any convention is. Like, oh, of course, I was. Waiting there's always for someone it. walking around with a lightsaber. Oh, and hey, refugees! This is the chapter we're uh, going to be ending on because we already did this in episode three. So, uh, so we will see you guys next time with episode three, and I don't know what we're going to talk about then, but... It yeah. won't be this stuff. No, it won't be this stuff. We'll continue that in episode five. So, see you guys in episode three. See ya! Bye.